What a learning lesson. Let's move on. <laughs> well, because I did sliding in there for a natural <laughs> one is why I did that. So um, he would guide you uh, past a few other bends in the, the cave and eventually go to what would have been uh, the Good pool of water. water. Um, you can see the well light streaming into this room. Um, let's get some sort of mapping uh, entrance from here. Kind of. Um, well light kind of in the central area you can see that there is a lower end of water here what um, I be able to it is that? literally just two sort of inches it is uh, a lower degree of would I be able to perceive anything else with this thing since I got night vision? Uh, if you wish to go give me a perception check of anything more, this is assuming everyone has night vision. There is a far off. I don't have night vision. I got torch. Oh, I, I, have have torch. I have a stone. But I got a, a tool I can make it like a light. There is a light. 19. Um, with a 19... You can um, you can note that there is a. Uh, did you have any pluses to perception? It would be intelligence. Also, okay. what were we? Have... Six plus three. Uh, in that case, if it's intelligence. Yeah, remember you had to update. You can tell before. that there is yeah, the, uh, around here. A door that is uh, appears to be a stone wall, but there is a door. Anyone else see a door? And since you said uh, line up something like this, and I asked like the guy with us, like, oh, know anything figure. about a door? Your figure. He says, uh, "This is nature." What are you going to me with this? I'm sorry. I oh, started heading towards the door. My own. Point it's better. Out. So you're breaking rank? Yeah, I'm heading forward and pointing out the door. Well, I'm more yeah. interested in the water. You said inches deep or? It's only about two to three inches deep, three in the center, maybe two around. There is a small trickle coming out of this particular wall um, that has kind of trying to fill. So pretty much that's it. That's not going to get deeper and to barely any room to pull anything out from that anyways. Yeah. I mean, it could. Maybe you can attempt to try to... Well, you're going to be probably pretty useless to try to break this trickle. Like, if something's blocked it or not. So what it's it up to efforts. That is actually, like, the light coming down from, from the top. The well. Okay. That's where they used to pull from. There is some here. And this is why... What yes. Jason was about. Yes. Very shallow, shallow pool. I don't like um, it. In total, it could be a couple gallons, but because it's spread across a lot. But. Uh huh. A couple of gallons and something lying there inside. Mm -hmm. well, I've been there before. There is um, information for your crew. You're pretty much out of water unless you try to force the water source somehow. This is now a dry air, dry zone. And I just knock on the door. Um, you hear kind of a sloshing. Hmm? Water? <laughs> In my head, I'm thinking water. Okay. But also thinking of I gotta maybe be a brave. slime. I gotta be brave. I'm going to the shower well, thing. Because I'm examining the water, I would actually be there. Go ahead and okay, I, I'm going to be there and see what's going on. I uh, figured he would be in here exploring, examining. He'd be like well. up over here and be calling up, We're out of water! We already knew that! It's worse than before! Uh, are there slimes down here? We should have got the, the emissary to send a few miners. Are there slimes down here? I yell. What is it, an Imperium? <clears throat> Imperium? 
a Warhammer 40k? Oh, absolutely not. It's actually Halo Hero Click stuff. That's a Marine. <laughs> oh. Um. Is there any way to open the door? You can attempt to. Attempt? You can Just attempt blast it. to find, uh, find some sort of lock. You push on it. It doesn't seem to budge very well. So. It's either like a strength roll to force it or some sort of finding the lock. Four. <laughs> yeah, that's not working. It's a door. Go ahead, Bob. Uh, first off, looking at the water source, poking it a bit. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Like doing I'm making it look like I know what I'm doing. Like doing this, maybe? Like no, at the water source where it's mm -hmm. coming in at. Mm -hmm. If my poking inadvertently causes something good, awesome. If something bad happens, I am hiding the fact and walking away. <laughs> okay, so you, you go ahead and you you poke at it, you know, the, the, the water pressure a little bit, and that's about it. And pretty it, much about the best you want to do is have to break that down. If you're lucky. But I guess heading over to him, then finding out why he's hitting a wall. Would I be able to transmute part of that door and just like a one by one cube just to see what's on the other side? You could try. Okay, then well, I do. Why are you a transmuter school? Yep. For all from the beginning. Yeah. So you uh where do you wanna do you have a particular part of the door that you want to uh transmute? The five foot not um, five foot, the, the one foot cube? Uh, well, I guess is it literally a one by one foot cube, yes. or is it literally material equaling one foot? No, it's a foot cube. Uh, foot cube. I'm doing it at like eye level just so I can see what's going on on the other side. So you go ahead and you you do so. The door is uh, a couple <laughs> inches thick because of the, the that, and then there's like a metallic uh, to it. Um, you do so, and you it's kind of dark, dusty. Night vision. Um, you recognize kind of the far wall and the, the three chairs from your vision. And that is when a large flesh-like blob blocks your, your vision, begins to ooze out of the door. Nope, nope. <laughs> I would like you to... Oh, he said, nope, nope. Do you then not, no longer co uh, concentrate on the spell? Would I be able to just fire, like, a my flaming spear, sphere into there real quick? Like, I the certainly do distance? not know the size of your sphere. The flaming sphere. Because if it's more than a foot in diameter of the sphere... Do you have fire? Or if that uh, lets basically you flaming it. sphere is a three foot dia uh, diameter yeah. sphere going with the original the, description of the spell. The early oh, they don't fit in. Um, but you can summon it within a certain range of you. So no. try to summon it on through the other side course, and blast away whatever. Old there. school. I don't know what oh, the new school is. Why I would want to make sure that you know the your scroll, your, your spell does. No, don't give it to me. I said, it's his spell. You should know his spell. I mean, I know my it spells. should be either on your spell what card or in your book. Flame Spear? <sighs> flame Spear? Oh, Spear or Sphere? Sphere. Oh, Yeah, sphere. Flaming Sphere. Yeah, you can create a five foot diameter sphere in an unoccupied space okay. of my yeah. choice within yeah. range. Yeah. You just do it on the other side of the door. Yeah, oh, you do yeah. see it. <laughs> blah. The team, the creature takes two d six fire oh, damage on a failed like, save. I knew it was fear, but I was afraid. Um, it has to make a. <laughs> does it have to make a uh, saving throw, or does it just hit? 
Uh, just like, you can't believe I did the other thing. It's a, uh, save. Which save? Uh, dexterity. Oh. Nope, it hits. It um, hits. Okay, so that is 2d6. I think I so, found out where we were all hallucinating. Sudden, we I don't hear... think it was a dream. Whoa, what the hell? And uh, take seven damage. All right. Seven damage. I don't think it was a dream, you guys. <laughs> uh, well, that is when... But the second one, I don't think so, too. <laughs> See how it feeds on memories. Uh, through the... Uh, it's similar to the... The door right. through cracks in the floor through the foot thing, you're going to have gigantic flesh ooze pouring through this door. It will actually attempt as since you kind of got to jump on it, it's going to attempt to actually engulf you while you're in its space. I need you to do a dexterity throw. No, I didn't want to not have to save somebody. To give you an example, it's not a cube. It is is I knew it had, there was something ooze related to going to be happening down here. Whether mold or ooze. I was fearing that that puddle of water would end up turning into some sort of ooze creature. I'll just I thought it was the fungus was most You need to watch Made in Abyss. Don't trust the water. Don't drink the water. Okay. Exactly. Are you going to blow At this point, I'm just going to start drinking blood. <laughs> I'm not going to That would be kinder. Oh. 11 plus 2. Kinder than a vampire blood. Blow, you did a 13. You just blow? <clears throat> well, oh, you flame? fortunately, that does not succeed. Shoot. Bang. Shoot. Take uh, 13 points of acid damage, but you oh. have a resistance, don't you? So yeah, you I take, take half, half on acid. So you will take uh, six. six. Yeah. But you are currently engulfed. In acid. Which means you need you can take on your next turn you can take a strength saving throw to try to get out. Uh oh. You're not very strong. Someone can help pull him out. My strength is on eleven at least. Creature cannot breathe. Not this one. It is currently blind. It is restrained. <laughs> oh and we'll take. Need a cookie? You sound like you need like a cookie. I threw the cookie I had at a dodo. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> what is that thing? As you see this blob of just like meaty flesh, and you can even see some like green skin oh. barely hanging off of this. Is it this blob? It sounds like Robin. This is what uh, transmutated undead looks like. This is like transmutation. But everybody necromancy. knows there isn't a necromancy teacher. What? I beg to differ. <laughs> I know. That's why I said what I said. <laughs> uh, are, so, are we initiative yet, or are we just randomly doing stuff? Oh, are we done? Um, if you want to go ahead and roll initiative, I'm going to have Rails currently be at the top next to the blob, and then if you want to roll in between I mean, each other. Or do we get a, an action or whatnot? No, no, I'm just seeing between you two because I easily figured out what they theirs to be. Uh, you're going first. Okay. I got 18. So, rails, blob. I, my dice didn't like it. Zag <laughs> and Jackson. And then I guess this other guy will roll a one. Hey. <laughs> He's still in terror. Oh. He's creating a new blob in his pants. <laughs> Brownish. <laughs> okay, so actually at the start of Zig's turn, as he is seeing this, I need you to actually make a constitution saving throw. Me? Yeah. Well, why? The what? The sound in the visage of this thing. Why do you hate me today? What and if, if Jackson you, wants to make it yeah. as well, because it's just viewing it. Why do you hate me today? What? Constitution <laughs> saving throw. Oh, look at him. He doesn't... I'm sorry, man. I, know, I love you too, but it happened. 
Look at that. I got a 20. Um, it does not bother you one bit, and you're currently immune to this effect due to those Jacksons. Uh, seen I have to it. see it because of the torch, ah, so I see you. what's yes. going on, so I unfortunately have to make the roll. Josh, you can't see me. Ten. <laughs> I'm not con-based, I'm dex-based. Yep. Um, I'm going to roll this a little bit lighter. It's going to just the the fear of it is going to mean that you can take one action next turn. There's there's a doubt to it. Light. Literally say completely enable. So to for act. me, what's worse? That's terrible. To you, it's better. You can take your full turn. He's going to have one action. As, oh, I was only planning on doing one action okay, anyway. I don't like the whole. You are currently now unconscious. It wasn't. In, it's a technical term. Incapacitated. Yeah, I mean, I'm... That's dumb. I'm frightened stiff, kind of, which I yeah. can understand that. But that would be your entire... Both your whole turn, and you have to just try to succeed again. What was that? That's horrible. Oh, oh I have to keep doing it? But I'm saying it... You Whatever action takes all your mm -hmm. turns, so you give you one action instead of... I, I either... That kills a lot of people. But yeah. it is Zeg's turn because he rolled first and he has his full action. Yay. He was not frightened. He's seen these before. I don't know. I've seen this before. Very sci-fi. <laughs> his closest friend. What? It's a block. <laughs> well, I don't know what to do. So you get out of you out of there or just start shooting that Take man. too long and he's dead. That's all I can say. Alright. But so at least I'm taking half, so Yeah. I like, could have been worse. So I got golfed is bad though. It's gonna sound bad. Yeah. But I'm gonna pull him out. Anyways. You're gonna take an action to move and then take another action to assist in a strength roll. Yeah. Okay. It would be based on your strength, and I'm assuming he wants to aid you so you get the help action. That means you'll have advantage on your strength yes. roll to Pull them out. So you roll two d twenties and take the highest because of the help action. Because every time I draw them together, it's like you see, I got a six. Yeah. And Ooh. I got a twelve. Six and twelve. Not enough. You're very stuck, man. Oh yeah, that's hands kind of. Oh, no. <laughs> no. You imagine like I'm pulling and he's like. No. In the hand again. I got outside. the blob all over again. You're a blob. <laughs> or, uh, the, no, the Jackson. Thing. The thing, yeah. Uh, Jackson, you uh, 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 I, I need an animal figurine. Just an animal figurine. Actually, I just like, yeah, get out there. You deal with it. Don't have a birdie. No, just a medium sized creature should be fine. Fine. Uh, Go ahead and use the steel defender because I have one. I just don't have an artificer. It's weird that there's now. No the question: there. Does it need to make a Constitution save to keep from being able to fight this thing or not? Visage. Um, yeah, if it's blind, it it's, won't have to worry. No, it has vision. It's a freaking axe speak. Yeah, <laughs> it will have to. <laughs> Two days, number day. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what did you put me in front of? <laughs> what creatures? Uh, what monstrosity summons me in front of this monstrosity? Yeah, I'm gonna already say that it just locks up. Yep. <laughs> that roll is lousy enough to all well, that. Yeah. What is a natural? Natural one? No, it was a natural three, but still, it wouldn't even break five. Don't, don't roll natural one, because Chroma will get stronger every time everybody gets. <laughs> Hans Ramora, if I remember your story right. Yeah. So that is your turn, unfortunately. He's going to <laughs> run into space, and he will attempt to... Uh, Get, give a strength roll to help you. Are you? I'm assuming you're aiding, mm -hmm. so he will get the advantage. It's not a good chance. Twenty there. Not twenty. 
This random guard just pulls you out of the blob. And you're a... My hero! Oh yeah, when he pulls me out, he realizes that... Uh, you transformed on yeah. the inside? Oh like, no! He like, grabs you by the... Like, thinks he's grabbing by the hands, but it's the antlers that pulls you right out. Don't <laughs> And I'm just like... Watch okay, out! That thing's tra- changing people that he eats! <laughs> Um, you know full well that's not what's happening. <laughs> I know, but I'm saving your secret. True. I will then rule, because I didn't make you have to do the whole fear-based thing that your cryptid nature uh, makes you some level of immune, so you don't have to roll a 15 constitution check to try to not freeze up. I'd say part of that would be because like, you see blood on my mouth and like, it tastes good. <laughs> like I just have a taste for this kind of thing. Like, not bad. All right. It is the start of your turn. Start of my turn. Yep. Uh, let's see. I am definitely like getting more distance between this, and I am going to go with like a. Uh, let's see. Are you a going- good old uh, shatter, I'd say. I, I, I was going to tell you, why don't you just go closer and eat it? I want it to be dead first. <laughs> might give me an opportunity, and once it's dead and its blood's all over for you, it might give me a chance to transmutate it. The water. I'll Probably try that. Eats it, it might try to eat its way out of it. True. <laughs> <laughs> This really thing is a whole new level, man. I'm okay, let's see. Shatter. It's worse than a mind flayer. No. I've learned my mistake. <laughs> Read the stat block. Okay. <laughs> Shit. So I'm going to like have the shatter like be at the end of the wall yes. to keep it away from white mm-hmm. effort and individuals. And it is... Uh, well, it 3D, has to make a... 3d8, and it's a constitution. Hey, he's going to roll for a constitution saving throw. Uh, 13. Uh, Let's see. Is that, uh, what's your difficulty? My difficulty? Uh, you determine it based on your caster modifier plus your bonus which is bonus is 3 your caster modifier is your intelligence what's your bonus to intelligence uh plus 3 okay so it needed to make it a 16 it, it failed all don't right. take all of it so two and one more 18 took 18 points of damage okay and uh, i do have another action in um, did bird. you move? Or? Yeah, I moved. That's so both. Get it. Yes. Get it. So it is currently going to be the flesh oozes um, action. <laughs> it is going to um, move up to its uh. speed. How fast is a blob of meat? Um, but yes. Zig... And Depends the other guy is going to have to attempt a <laughs> dexterity throw. So they need some of this. No. What? No, oh, no, stop me from sneezing. Dex- <laughs> we'll that'll, get it out. That'll that'll burn. Burn. So Zig, you need to do a dexterity saving throw. I do what? Dexterity. The elf actually made it. He rolled an eighteen. The elf is doing great today. I can see that. It's like, no! This elf is doing work. You do not have Wait, advantage. Waiting on you. Unless you have advantage due to. <laughs> what was it? Hug <laughs> me! <laughs> 5, 10, 15, 20. <laughs> you are currently engulfed and you take. More damage. 14 points of acid damage. <laughs> you hate me today. Why, y'all? What I did. Is it because, right. Yeah, is it because... So that's his like, one turn of just using engulf. Um, he's just so far away. He's going to have to then just 
move again into the water to attempt to engulf you. Do a dexterity saving throw. <laughs> I got this trained. Yep. Do I get advantage? Yeah, actually. Okay. Good. Uh, that's a eight. And that's all. Uh, 26. Okay. So you have evaded as it has just slammed into this wall. Our turn. Uh, Zeg, you are currently inside Digested. and uh, dying. Uh, yes. <laughs> Can I do something about it? Let me see exactly how it goes. Can I shoot it? Can I use? Spell? You can attack from the inside. You currently cannot breathe. You're currently blinded and you're currently restrained. So your attack roll will be at disadvantage. You can attempt to escape with a uh, strength saving throw of a fifteen. Can I use intelligence this time? Since I got <laughs> armor? <laughs> I use my wits to escape this situation. I certainly do not know if you want to... You could probably do some sort of spell with the inside and not have to deal with the disadvantage because of restrained. Well, or without hurt uh, hand components. Let's see, it, this thing is made of metal? No, it is flesh. a blob of flesh. As you're looking at it, it seems to almost have been made of several different small... Bodies that have been blobbed together. It, it's just, yeah, there seems to be a loose uh, green patches of flesh. It's it it's sounds it's, it's gonna sound like I'm gonna get crazy, but I gotta use the spell heat metal on my armor. Okay, that could actually affect both of you now. Yes. Yes, I do not know how much damage that ends up being. Uh, it should be 2d, uh, from with heat metal, it should be 2d6, but uh, you'll have to pull up your book for that one. Yeah, I will. <coughs> heat metal should be in the core. Oh, yeah, it's it's a straight up common spell. It would be, It'll be in that book right there. Definitely both of you. 2d8s, apply it 2d8 fire damage to the lot of you. Wow. I'm assuming you're choosing to fail a saving throw, to, or do you take half of the succeeded well, saving throw? This is a funny part. It, it says, if a creature is holding or wearing the object and takes damage from it, the creature must succeed on the constitution saving throw or drop the object if it can. If it doesn't drop the object, he has disadvantage on attack rolls, ability check until the start of your next turn. So it only disadvantage what? you, though, but there's no dropping it in the monster. Well, well he's I, trying to, th he's thinking that because all the water Oh, it can't drop because it is holding it. It would have disadvantage on all its attack rolls for the next. <laughs> so I'm not holding it. But he's but, holding you. Yes, yeah, so he has a disadvantage. And, and the question is, is does he release him, him from being engulfed? It's a whole situation of uh, I'm not in here. So but that's why we call it a beat brain moment. That's very good. So I don't have the health to do that. No, thank you. <laughs> and since you have another, the blood has another disadvantage. Yeah, that's a good I'm not inside of it. Yeah. There's so no way he'd be like, oh, yeah, I'm going to dodge that. You thing. could heat metal. Um, it would be at disadvantage, and you would be at disadvantage. So it would just be regular rolls for attacking against it, too? So yeah, but not hitting. So that will be just damage. Yeah, well, this will definitely just be damage, yeah. Yeah. You're Unless he wants to do a constitution roll after I do the damage to spit, him, spit me out. Or that has a lot to do with how smart you think this thing is. Right, just give hey, it passed a test. It knows what color the sky is. I mean, uh, oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> you asked the question, I gave you the answer. Yes, yes, exactly. Go ahead and roll for damage. Got uh, 10. Uh, Zeg, you are like the modifier for intelligence or not? Um... I think that's just for the saving throw difficulties? No, for the saving throw. Uh, yeah, go ahead and add your intelligence modifier then. How much is your intelligence for? Four. Okay. So, 14. 
Right. Um, is there anything else you're doing for your second action? There's one action. Wait, I have to take damage too. Oh. Yeah. And that was what? 14? It was 14 points of damage. You know what? Self alive. You, you know what I gotta do, right? Mm -hmm. I gotta do another heat metal. But the question is is it the blob that's gonna release me? It's substantially damaged. Go ahead. You do another heat metal. Roll damage. You are nice. microwaving this thing. Yeah. So now is a game from the inside six, out. Fourteen plus four. Eighteen. More. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got the stakes. Um, also, since it's now the end more, of right? your turn, I would like you to do a constitution constitution saving throw. <clears throat> I'm dead. As the acidic nature of this thing. You're the one that decided to burn yourself twice. <laughs> Did you see that roll? Uh, <laughs> how much was your roll? <laughs> he failed the con save. If five. So Just bring me rolling. Thirty-two <laughs> points of acid damage. I'm super dead. You're dead? Yeah. How, how much hit points are you at? Remember, I did 14, was it? And I was 33, 14 plus... How much negative are you at? I way past. But I need to know the exact number. Because our death is half your maximum hit points of negative. Okay. You are unconscious. Probably. So let's say I did 14 first. And now it's like 14, 18, right? Yes, so you I just got took minus 32. Four. That will be minus 4 at some point. And then what was the other one? It's acid damage was 32 points of acid damage. Minus 32. That will be 36. Negative 36, yeah. and your maximum hit points are? It was 33. So minus... What? Negative 3. Uh, what is your max? Your normal maximum hit 55. points? Fifty-five. And you got to negative how much? So that will mean I will be negative three. You're at negative three right now. Yes. Okay, you're unconscious. Okay. okay. You have. Okay, let me do it again. You have like negative twenty more to take. I could. I could have write this down fast as any can on a calculator. You've took in over this last round. Okay, I did it right. It's thirty-five. Negative thirty-five. You're at negative thirty-five yeah. out of all that stuff that happened. All out of fifty-five hit points, mm -hmm. he's negative thirty-five. That's that. Yes. That is a death. That's death. Oh Lord. Oh no. Oh. And I'm. My actually hit point is 55. Yeah, uh, you started at 55 hit points, right? So yes. And you took how much damage on the first attack? His 14. thing was 14, 18, 32. Two. And the first time he got hit by acid was... Wait, he already took acid damage? No. Yeah, when he was first grappled, I thought he took acid damage. Oh, yes, he did. He took... Uh... Well, we didn't do it, right? How much was the acid damage from that? Because it was a lot less. It was... Well, even without that first initial acid damage, he took 64 mm -hmm. points of damage. 64 took it out of the original 55. Would only mean he's, he's at, at negative, negative 9. 9. He's not at negative 30-something. Well, then... well. The Even initial. at it, I think it was less because he only he takes took half the damage than the. Uh, yeah, but even then, the f he still didn't write down the initial acid damage that he. The does. initial acid damage can only be a total of eighteen. Okay, so and max, and it wasn't the max. But he heat mellowed twice, so he would get hit by the heat mellow twice. Well, that what that was the fourteen and, and the, the eighteen, 18. Mm -hmm. and the thirty-two was so the acid even then, damage while it's, involved. He would have been. He's more than negative nine right now. I think it was. Hey, like I, 
think it was around 14 from that. Four, that's only 14 and a half of that is 7. So technically he's... Negative 15? Somewhere around negative 15 and negative 20. But that, that would be still unconscious, but savable. If we can get to him. Someone has to get him out. But things still lie. the start of the end of his next turn. I have to get to him somehow, but as far as I know, he's still engulfed and things still alive. And I'm still not fully functional. Unless you want to do... Well, the creature has to do a constitution save. So he can Certainly does around. have to do a constitution save. And it actually twice. Okay. We'll do... Um, that one! It expels you to the water. Let's just say happily back laying down. Any epic words as you fall out? Falling unconscious? Falling, Falling unconscious? I'll be like laughing. Off the acid. <laughs> that was smart, huh? <laughs> That's the floor. Well, you got this, guys. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I did a lot the of damage. The problem that I run into is I don't know your status. I just know you got kicked out and you laughed, so therefore you're alive. Yeah. So I don't know what damage you took in there. Two, until I roll, I still only have one action. Yes, it is the start of your turn. You make another... Uh, con save. Con save, yeah. Yeah, I'm only taking, by you limiting me to only one action, I only have one action, and I'm next to something highly dangerous. Yes, that is confirmed to have a 20-foot movement speed per action token. So you have an action, you also get to save for your axe beak to try yeah, to take more than one. do the axe beak. Axe beak is because the DC is 15. Unfortunately. Axe beak ain't doing nothing either. Um, I'm just beating feet. Getting individuals between me and it. Yep. Because, oh. yeah, I could do a heal, but again, I'm not a healer. I don't know his health status. It is Rail's turn. Alrighty, Rail's is immediately going to pull out a skeletal bone and just, like, plant it into the ground and have a skeleton come out. Action skeleton, go ahead and put your skeleton oh, yeah. up. Hey, skeleton's immune to fear effects. I mean, uh... Yes, yes, it's currently yes. blind. I mean, uh, they're brave. <laughs> Do you have all your skeleton stats somewhere? Or no? Uh, let's see. I have stats for uh, action. A medium undead spirit. You have way more than that, so you should have skeleton. Ah, oh, jeez. In that case, where did it go? If it, I have... The, that is... Here. Nope. And I honestly do not know what book that is from. And I printed out all three Unless, Why is it red? Unless this, all, this counts for all of them in general, but you have specific stats for certain kinds of undead on the paper, so I was thinking maybe it, you grouped it all together, but it's just different ones can do different things. I thought there was a Three, 20 three. for 20 hit points for skeletal only. Oh, okay, then that's just the individual slight rule. Because I didn't see much of a difference, but they had the full stat block. All 20 right. hit points for the skeleton. 20 hit points for skeleton. And it's got all this stuff it can do. All right. Would it also take a turn for it to do its attack? Um, or would it have you to, have to take order? your order to give it? I believe. 
Let's see. <clears throat> Did this thing even even hurt? Like really hurt? Let's see, would it uh, take a action to move and then attack, or would I just have to summon an attack? You could have thrown it closer. Oh, could give it. that. Maybe thrown it over here, let's say that. Or That's still going to have to move to go do what you wanted it to do. And that movement action would be in vain. Huh? The movement will take an action. The I gave you a way to give so. up, get him close to it by throwing it, but... Oh yeah, I have uh, ground. My bad. Okay, so I have ranged attack with it. So... Let's see. Grave Bolt, so... Mm. My spell attack modifier to hit, range 150, one target, 2d4 plus 3 plus necrotic. Okay, so your spell modifier is that 6. Well, you guys weren't nature. fans of those? I really need to know what you guys prefer. Oh, the I'm, lime's pretty good, though. I'll tell you right now, that's a no-go for me. Sorry. Oh, I do have plane if you wish to dip. Yeah, I know. I just, I'm so sorry. I, I don't feel like a dip. You can have another Danish. So roll to hit. So 12. Um, it is good, but I failed the flame. 12 in total? So it's a 6 plus your 6, or is it 12 no, plus you your rolled six? a natural 12. Okay, so it's an 18. I rolled right. That definitely hits. Alrighty, so... Uh, 2d4 plus. What is this? It's a verde. A it's what? a green salsa. D4. Oh. I thought they say something that would give me so much trouble. <laughs> I'm supposed to know this? Oh, that's yeah. it. Yes. <laughs> I'm not messing it, Bob. <laughs> it wasn't it. Well, we also it, just saw. It's, it's a Hispanic thing. We, we just that. saw five plus necrotic damage. We don't do that, Jason. Five points of damage is all of it necrotic. Where is it says the plus the nec spells and level necrotic. Okay, so, so it, you took five. It's taking um, eight because it's resistant to to uh, necrotic damage. Okay, hit it with the lights. If you think that's bad, remember what we just saw Pedro do from our other gaming group. He right. put ketchup on his taco, on his burrito. No, that's wrong. Because he can't stand spicy. He's Puerto Rican. Me too. I know. Why he can't? <laughs> ketchup <laughs> as wow. a as a, uh, like a spice. salsa. Yes. Now everybody's it's panning like... knows you don't put ketchup on your taco. So yeah. you bolt this, it, <laughs> it fires <laughs> more of the the, the people. Right? The bone is what's doing damage, and you notice that there is a resistance to necrotic damage. All right, so uh, resist necrotic. Yes. All right, so that's not good. <clears throat> what is that? Someone in wars? Is that card game? Mm -hmm. I enjoy some real wars. Um, it's got really weird factions. Uh, swamp orcs and psychics and sand goblins. Oh you can, you can castle cool with your oh. sup. Right, it was a cut. Um, huh. Phoenix elves. They're all about elves that like fire in the I tundra. Heard you say, oh my, I got the reference. That's a world I wouldn't mind running a campaign in. But they reset the world. Jungle elves, where you have uh, elves riding lions and stuff. You should do that campaign. On. But lions wow. aren't. Oh, no, lions are in the jungle. In the really. song. Not in really. the jungle. The mighty jungle. Lions the lion sleeps sleep tonight. No. <laughs> okay. So, your action happens. Sorry, it's my turn. This yes. thing's going to blob. <laughs> they told me that. I was like, what? My head went like. So, and then, one, and two, on <laughs> it attempts to blob your thing, it needs to do a dexterity roll, I don't know what's, what's his dex stats. Let's see. Uh, dex. Pretty much straight up his dex. Dex is, uh, my dex? Yeah. 
No, the it's Dex. skeletons. Dex. It's Dex is plus three. So, so you go ahead and roll and add three. Did you just lose like skeleton just now? Possibly. Thirteen plus three, sixteen. It succeeded. Okay. It's going to then attempt uh, one, two, both of you, three. Axe Beak and you. Okay. Because you're still small. Axe Beak is going, hug me! So let's see, let's roll. Two plus two. <laughs> Four. I <laughs> boy. I boy. Um, both of you take 18 points of damage and are currently engulfed. Okay, nine. Okay. Acid resistance. Why you open the door? Secret door. Who doesn't open a door? It's just like his home. The it thing is, is he could stop concentrating at any point in time and seal that thing back in. Yeah. Could have. What That's caught him off guard, though, was seeing the thing they saw from his dream, and they had him thinking for a second. Like, wait, what? I gotta do, like, the invincible. You have to think, man! Think! <laughs> <laughs> I like uh, that guy. He, he's, uh, okay, so that's that's turn. It is currently Zig's turn to do a saving throw, a death saving throw. It is just a 20 cider, no adds. If you go 10 or higher, it's a good. If you go lower, it's a negative. If you get a crit low, it's two 18. negatives. Okay, so, so you I got one like more both. point to getting almost awake. Okay. But here's the problem. He's in two inches of water. You can die in two inches of water. Oh, wait. <laughs> so I'm not awake fully? You're not. You have to succeed three different times to get You're not door. dead. If you do a critical, it's two counts. If you get a, a critical fail, again? Next. unfortunately, that's your track. Next round. Okay. Uh, all right. Can I do ready? something other than... Okay. Yay! Fifteen! Okay, you've... Finally got used to the smell and, and the, the axe beak <laughs> is digested. Um, <laughs> uh, and that's only makes more sense. Doing firebolt. Is it a fireball? Yes. yes. I do okay. It oh I got a range hit. I got a roll to hit thing, that's right. Duh. Uh then you're gonna hit the wall. Oh look at you. Actually look at you where you're pointing at. <laughs> Just messing Alright, fine, there are you happy? <laughs> Just so what did you roll? Uh I'm pulling that information up now. So I wrote that down. Could be your spell thing. So what's your spell bonus plus okay, your proficiency? I think. Three yeah. Plus. Uh, Telling. Telling. Should be AC seventeen. Hit. Hit. All right. He takes uh, eleven points of damage. You like Chucky here? I can do that twice. You like Chucky here? Yes. <laughs> All right. He's Doing off. it again. Oops. Same roll. Nice. 17 points of damage. And that is fire, by the way. As it uh, screeches because it's last experience with uh, fire and dispels. Uh, oh, wait. We'll actually dispel you. Well, that's. This is this actually. Is consumed. No, it's literally gone. It goes poof. So it dispels like. Ow. Oh. So fire is its way to get to cough up its secrets. Run! <laughs> well, he got frustrated with having fire inside of him. Okay, right? so that is currently right, the, Josh? the blob's turn, unfortunately. Um, let's roll a four-sider. Oh, um, he doesn't go? Oh, wait, yes, it is his turn. Yes. He's going also, to... Are you cheating? 
Yes. And also, don't I go before him? Before Look at him. Blob. Now he feels you, bad. You go before the blob. That's what I'm... Wow, you are really trying to roll. kill the party. Today, right? <laughs> Just making up for the one shot. In the normal campaign. And that's, that's natural, right? Um, All right. Now that He's going to go ahead, move... The, the church is going to run up, stabilize you, go get a healer's <laughs> kit, and he has to roll to see if it actually works. That's the minimum. Um, you're currently conscious with one hit point. The, church, the, the guy that led you down there is going to run up there, stabilize you as his turn. All right, so you're stable now. <sighs> Not necessarily up. Oh, well, it's up to you. Okay, <laughs> it's up to you. Um, I'm playing dead. Whatever. I keep forgetting about the NPCs, especially the ones that are boring. Um, go ahead now, Rails. It is your turn. What I got going on? Let me try the salsa. Good. It's less spicy than this. Yes, it. Oh, then much is. That's better. I like it though spice. I hate the fake of spice. Yeah, the fake of spice. There, there's a difference between Does spice resistance and fake. to acid stack if I were to change the, the spice? stone? A fake spice. To a fourth? Uh, that's, a, that's a very not fifth edition, but I want to reward you, sure. All right. Yeah, I, want to do. I want to change the Dark Vision Stone and change it to. You have to cast a transmutation, transmutation spell. spell. You have a transformation spell. Yeah, I have transmutation. It's a it's a spell with the category of transmutation. Oh. And you have to category. actually cast it. That would be an action, and then it will change it. But then you'll have the benefit of whatever the transmutation spell is. Yes, you can't be like. Yeah, I'm using a slot. I'm casting this. Okay, uh, spider climb. I'm just going to... Give like, yourself spider climb. Then... Yeah, spider climb. Uh, how big... Just... How tall is this cavern, anyway? Um, there would be... Mm, to the stars. <laughs> <laughs> Up the well. <laughs> uh, there would be a good, probably, uh, 20 foot... Uh, area and how tall is this blob? That one, I don't think they give that information anymore. Not for height, it is technically a large ooze, so it's ten, at, at least 10, 10 foot. foot. Yeah, so it's at least 10 foot. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just get on the ceiling and get ready to prepare some attacks. Good. So, does Doing the transportation spell takes yes, it, a turn it, and I move. Move will take a turn, but you'll also now be able to give the, the now you have well I guess his torch lets you see, but uh, you have uh, double resistance to toxic damage. And that will be your turn. The blob then, not having anything else to target, um I'm standing uh, off you. Oh. You added your spell cast and your movement. That's yeah. not that's yeah. not him. That's Jackson. Yeah. Well, he's Shoot. up on a wall. He's up on a ceiling. I'm on a ceiling, but also that skeleton's nearby. I'm just. Could but I get to reflex to get out of it, right? Yeah. You can yeah. uh, attempt to do a dex. get out. <laughs> oh. Eleven. Uh, Bad. 19 points of damage. He's and really it to... is Zeg's turn. Hey, what do you want me to do? We need to break this thing before it kills one of us. You need to save the day. It has a weakness to fire. Sadly, I use all my level 2 spells with the heat metal. You know, you didn't have your spell to attack. But, oh, yeah. He has to take a action to yeah, get an oh. order. Yeah, action, though. Unfortunately. It's good to put a body in between. I can use Firebolt. Good. I'm using Firebolt. I think he's a D10. Right? I'm mm. sure. Uh, minimum D one D10, depending on your level. 
uh, upcast. Yeah, so it'd be. I think there's a either a miss or a. I have to just randomly start memorizing. Oh, uh, I know for spell. me it's two d ten for my level. What is this flesh? Well, that's if you cast it at a different level. What is this uh, thing of flesh movie. made of? Yeah, it's the same thing. Could I see like what it's made of? It seems like made of flesh. Like it's made of several different bodies fused together. Yeah, bodies in the floor. Of something that seems to be small and has green. Yeah, I'm getting ideas. You got an idea? Yeah. Better than opening the door? It probably was a, a whole bunch of goblins. I mean, um, <laughs> that's what attacked the cart. Alright, so uh, wait, he has a second. Well, it serves them right. I gotta attack it with Firebolt. Okay. On my range. Burn it. I got 20. Oh, nice, natural. Hits. Um, um, is it critical? It yeah, would I... be a critical. In the critical rules, does that mean maximum damage plus something rolled on top of? How did we used to roll, roll this? Or spells? Mm. Spells, there was a point where spells could not crit. Correct. Oh, but I there think are we've, some we've rolled it before. Are we doing like full damage? Yeah. Uh, that will be 20. Target spells, total, you have two. What? I do attack again. Yeah, I think we, we have done full damage as how we did crits before. Yeah, with targeted spells, you could always crit as long as you had to roll to hit. Um, it is still around. It is in a lot of pain. There's chunks of it collapsing, yes. So I attack again with Fireball? You can. And that was my luck. Three. Three, Three is it? What's your spell plus modifier? Four. Plus four. Four. That's actually a hit. Time so. class of seven. <laughs> so he's very powerful, but he has... Tanky, but you it, can hit it easy. Glass hit. cannon. No, he has too much health. He just has no armor. Oh, a glass sponge. Well, a tanky sponge. That's a thing, isn't it? A, a glass, glass sponge. sponge. A ten. A two. Well, how do you want to do this? End it. How do you want to end it? I'll be like, well, I'm using the cannon. So at this point, I'm like charging it like really. <laughs> yeah, like Mega Man. And just shoot like a big bang attack, like very Dragon Ball Z, everything is blowing. So it just go. And I'll be like on the floor again in the water. <laughs> yeah, so it just blows apart. I just have my mouth open, just like eating like whatever, like blood and chunks. Because I'm a Mega Man fan. That's and yet Real again, blood. Jackson is covered in blood and gore. <laughs> <laughs> you can't catch a break. Okay. And is there any bits okay? of pieces like up? skeleton parts right, so. or <laughs> dead parts I could utilize? Um, you will note that there is no parts of like the pelvis or legs. There seems to be a lot of uh, rib cage, spinal cord up to like the skull, and there would be skulls here. Uh, would I be able to utilize skulls for my magic yet? Yeah. Okay, how many skulls do we got? Mm. There, well, I would Yeah, roll. what kind of skulls are they? <laughs> you would have to roll a couple things to determine that. How many Certainly. skulls you would find, there would be six. Six skulls? To determine what they are, it would be a health per, uh, perception roll. Like a, a medicine to determine... Medicine. I was getting ready for Roland, or that other character, the monk, or maybe the drow if I want to make. Or the you character. were less than 10 hit points away from half. 16 plus character. 3, yeah. so 19. Oh, uh, what it did to me, if I was in there for one more round and got hit by the acid, I would have been dead. No questions asked. Not, oh, he's dying. No, he's dead. Are you proud of me, Josh, what I did? <laughs> That it was, was very crazy. reckless. It was cool. Gave it a natural fear of fire there. It is not, a, like, especially damaged by fire. Is it radiant? So what I mean, I don't know Yes, you'll like actually it. be able to notice that at first glance, it kind of looks like it would be children's um, skulls. But as you appear, the, the cranium is uh, malformed in a way, and you would detect that it is 
uh, goblin in nature. Oh, six it. goblin skulls? Six goblin skulls, but you remember uh, back when you were dealing with the uh, water treatment plant in Dry Dock. You remember the goblins that led you to deal with that uh, gray ooze that one time. Just totally remember all this of how they led you through the tunnels. You trusted them. Are they did, they, these connected? They're it's the same species. I just... It's an odd thing that that one time you split the party, the one time you were away from Trace, was the same time that you had an encounter with goblins and oozes. I take a look at these, I'm like... Uh, it, <laughs> you'll live again one at one point, my friends. <laughs> I like to just put them in the bag. You'll live again. Uh, okay. Who needs attention? Moan now or forever hold your peace. I need attention. Um, uh, all right, so nobody needs attention. I, so need, I need healing. I need attention. I need everything. The guard, after he has so used the healer kit to help you, would actually d dispense one of his own healing potions uh, I'll use, himself on you. I'll use starting my hit dice. Well, you can only do that when you're resting. Oh, yeah, when I'm resting. I didn't even read three hit points. You uh, I do have an eight spell, ten. too. Well, oh. because nobody moaned. About what? Hey, I need, I need healing attention. That's there. not moaning, that's whining. There's a difference. I get in the middle of everyone and I use the AIDS spell. Hold on, how am I going to do this? Okay. Giving us AIDS. HP. So everybody I got it, I got it. I got you, Jason. Mm. Yeah, it's been a while since you've had that pull up. You had it from mm, the beginning. I need healing. Mm. See, I don't have, have that. I don't have just have like necromantic needs. and violent spells. Right, John? He said moaning. Mmm. Mmm. I gotta now debate if that's actually getting edited. <laughs> mm, that won't happen. <sighs> oh, <laughs> and he has to say it in the Jeez. very racist Japanese accent. You know what I'm saying? That was a joke on all my watch. <laughs> like, every game, you, every game you play, it'd be like, I need healing. Help it I need to get it. poked with this stick for 10 points. Okay, so I got 20. You got 10 more hit points back. And you both remember you six. got five from uh, everybody mm, got five. Why did you with a tip? <laughs> <laughs> this has got weird. <laughs> well, he was a. Remember you got five from the AIDS bill. Everybody did. That's yes. What you did. Get seven more back. Oh, the skeleton takes my its turn immediately after me. Actually. Oh, so yes. it has a full Oops. turn. God, I, I should have read closer. My bad. Yeah, that's why I was dealing with the. I'm thinking about like a lot Would of. Would the skeletal pain. soldier be able to take off its head and roll it into the small space, the one by one space, just to see what's on the other side? And Do you, you get to see through them, right? Uh, see through them? No, but it knows my language. It currently has no eyes. And yes, I had. Well, I guess you could. Well, well, obviously, the door is. It, well, you could push them through. Well, here's the thing. It's perception is ten. There's no I other creatures see. coming through the doorway, so and it has dark, you know of it has dark vision. So it can see what's in that room. I'm going to look for a way to open the door. Okay, I am one to do this. Uh, did I do that perception, or would that be? Oh, you, there's no disabled device. Josh, I got a question. What would have happened? I was uh, inside of him. And I used the bottle of the mole that I have, and just like inside of it. What would have happened if he shattered that? Okay, that's a what if that's actually really good. Um, he would have had a nightmare about being on the grill. It's okay. <laughs> this is totally canon, but you guys didn't have that encounter. It would probably spit you out and then take at least a few turns. I have to make a will save and just cowering because. These are the guy, the the things being experimented on before. Yeah, I know that. I knew that's that. a pretty easy guess, but yeah, you would have probably got released. No, so that wasn't a safe way. That would have scared the piss out of this thing. But I gave you uh, a new fear of a fire. Chris. And then you did that. You did no, a different blood thing. is on the floor. Yes, twenty three. 
23, you uh, easily determine where the lock is, and you can you know that it is locked. And I know there's a whole different role for the, the lock check, but you ha I'm assuming you have the tools. Oh, I got sleight of hand. I got, uh, <laughs> there's my thieves tools. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm assuming with a roll that big.